Now, listen, any person who is in that position with the challenges that he or she would have, um, I would commend them. Uh, the set of challenges that he has to do um, to, to really help his country are, are, are unbelievable. Um, and the main thing that he's trying to do is bring back stability to Egypt. We need Egypt. Egypt is, uh, is, the, is the linchpin of, 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 of the Middle East. Yeah, it is, uh, you know, they say Umid Dunya. They're, 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 they're the, the center of, 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 of the Middle East for many, many reasons, historically, culturally, um, uh, religiously. Um, uh, and we all need Egypt. Um, and I, I, I believe that he is bringing strength to his country, he brings stability to his country. Uh, the economy uh, is a major challenge for, his, uh, for him, but at the same time he has to deal with instability in Sinai, which we're all trying to help him on. Uh, he is uh, on the largest, one of the largest borders of Libya, which is, like I said, I mean, <laughs> we're all talking about our concerns on Syria and Iraq. Imagine uh, what his problems are facing uh, Libya, what he has to deal with. So all of us have to stand by the Egyptians and by him because he's got so much on his plate. And, you know, when I worry about my challenges and I think what he has to go through, I mean... <laughs>